Hey y'all, it's Mommy Wata and I am back. Thank you so much for your support of Mommy Wata Tarot. Please continue to like, share, and subscribe to this content. And y'all just, you know, I appreciate you rocking with me, but what I'm not gonna do is go into 2024 still dealing with the same stuff that I was dealing with on this channel for the past few years. I think it's very weird and obsessive that these same select energies keep trying to destroy my platform, keep trying to ban my platform, get my platform blocked, when it's all kind of multiverses on, you, on YouTube where people do all kind of stuff, say all kind of things about actual folks that's out here living and breathing, and nobody don't fuck with them, but somebody wants to fuck with me so hard and it's weird and it's obsessive and it's going to get to a point where the only way you're going to be able to get a reading out of me is if you book me on my website because it's, it's getting old and I don't got to deal with it 111 and who people think pay me that's not who pays me okay the most high God put money in my pocket and this obsession to try to break me financially because you can't stand seeing me win, bitch, you will never, okay? So, pretty soon, you know what I'm saying? You're going to have to book me to get a reading out of me because I won't be antagonized. I don't have to deal with it. It's getting old. It's getting played out. You know, people want to fuck with a... a, a Poor black woman, so bad. Okay? They want to fuck with her so hard. A old, poor, lowly black woman. So she must got some power. Because it ain't no way that nobody fucking with an old, lowly ass black woman if she ain't got nothing over here going on. That's of value. It just ain't no fucking way. But like I said, I ain't got to be dealing with this shit. But <laughs> I ain't going to be dealing with this shit. Okay? And still going to be straight. So, Holy Spirit, what do you want us to know about this download? Somebody think that the blind is leading the blind. That you don't really know what the fuck you talking about. But you got people thinking that you know what the fuck you talking about. You somehow been able to convince them of that. And they aren't in agreement with what you say and do. Like, what else is fucking new? Because this this type of crap right here, and it be old ass motherfuckers that be on this type of shit too. Grown old people with gray hairs and they crotching on their face that shouldn't even be worried about this type of crap. They should be old and and evolved enough to not be so fixated on what somebody else is saying or doing. But they can't help themselves. Clarify Holy Spirit, because this shit done got old now, I'm telling you. I'm just trying to fuck with me shit. Judgment, that's where they ask going to be, up under judgment. There's this judgment energy who feels like a queen of wands is the blind leading the blind with this moon card here, okay? So she, she, she is public enemy number one to this motherfucker. I'm trying to tell you now, this is, it's weird though. Because this judgment energy got all day to fuck with a queen of wands, okay? But a queen of wands is in her own space. A queen of wands is doing her own thing. A queen of wands ain't fucking with nobody. A queen of wands take care of her. She look out for those who are in her circle, in her community, but she ain't overstepping her boundaries into anybody else's space or life. And it's like this judgment energy is hell-bent and, and feeling like this queen of wands has overstepped her boundaries somehow. It's like he hell-bent on making her go in another direction in life. But what she does is help people heal and go in better directions in their life. Okay, she ain't the blind leading the blind. She's somebody who's inspiring people to create new starts and opportunities for themselves. She helps people revisit 
their past and heal from it, to be encouraged from what they may have experienced, what they have already gone through, what they have learned. She helps people redirect negative energy, if you, if you ask me. Queen of Wands, Moon, Devil, Ace of Wands, Page of Wands to the Six of Cups. She's somebody who's doing the exact opposite of what this judgment energy thinks she's doing. She leading people to a Ten of Pentacles. That ain't the blind leading the blind. What it's really giving is that this judgment don't like that this old lowly, earthy energy, this Queen of Wands vibe here, is has all of that power. Okay, that's that's what this shit is. It's giving that. He don't like that she got this power. So this judgment must be a masculine. Because I keep saying he. Or hearing he. I'm telling you. So he watching this woman. Been watching her for a long ass time. Trying to figure out a way that he can refute who she is and what she does. Clarify Holy Spirit. He Seven of, seven of swords. I'm trying to tell you. He want her to be the devil moon so bad that he in the moon with the devil and the seven of swords trying to stop her because he swears she the blind leading the blind. But the damn fifth through ninth card out here shows us the opposite of that. Okay, that she ain't that, that she's actually helping people, healing people, allowing them to have positive start, new starts in their lives and move forward in positive ways. That's what an Ace of Wands is. That's what a Ten of Pentacles is. A Page of Wands is somebody who encourages all of that high vibrational energy. This motherfucker blind, if he can't see that this Queen of Wands is of a high vibration, but he can see that. The reason why she irritate him is because he is of a low vibration. I hear with this damn seven of swords, page of cups energy. He is somebody who don't give people, but just a little bit of what they need so they can keep going. Okay. She, he give people, he want people just to get a little bit of what they need to keep going. He don't actually want them to achieve something greater than this. Okay. He want them to be pacified. He want them to stay at a certain level. This woman gets people up out of some sort of limbo energy and she helps them attain greater. I'm trying to tell you, she, she let people know that they can do better than this. They can have that if they want to out of life. And this judgment energy don't like it because see, people are actually attaining this out of life. Okay. People are actually winning lovers behind that based off of choosing to listen to her to follow her to believe that she is the ideal person they should take advice from they winning he he trying to say she the moon with the devil now i'm trying to tell you and the ace of pentacles with the lovers is falling up underneath that that's her real energy that's what that's the type of of energy she produces in others and that's what he want to stop because he don't like that she has all of that power. It's a line where they be like, I can't think of who said that. I think it's Kanye. And he'd be like, who are you to have all that power or some shit like that? That's what I keep hearing. That's how he feel. He know this woman is, can see the light. He see that shit. He know that shit. The Ace of Pentacles is falling right up under the moon. He want to feel like she in the dark, but now, nah, baby, it's all light over there. Ace of Cups. It's all love and light over there. It's all love and light over there. And she's going to continue to be this outpouring energy of love and light to other people. No matter what the fuck this judgment death energy do. Because, see, I'm tired of people like this because they think they run... They think they run everything. I done told y'all the, the Holy Spirit paid me 
The Holy Spirit put money in my pocket and food in my mouth. Okay? 1001. Somebody need to wake the fuck up to that. Because people cup going to overflow if the Most High God wanted to overflow. I don't give a fuck what you think you're doing. 1010 to end shit for somebody behind the scenes. If God want that cup to overflow, that shit going to overflow. This Queen of Wands already got three aces out here in reference to her high vibrational energy. That's the damn opposite of the blind leading the blind. Okay? So... All this effort that this judgment death energy is putting towards trying to stop this woman, he need to go check his motherfucking self because I'm tired of biting my tongue on this channel. I'm tired of working around people's feelings, but they be out here doing this fuck shit against others and then don't want you to say nothing about it. They want you to be quiet while they keep fucking you over in the background. Child boo. Because enough is enough. And God going to show this judgment energy as something too now. Two of Cups in reverse, Two of Pentacles. Okay? Because something, something going to shift here. It's getting to the point where this judgment energy is trying to figure out how he can cut this woman off from creating partnerships with others that help them. It's like he want her to stop what she's doing completely. I'm sick of picking up on this shit. I'm sick of picking up on these misogynistic ass men. Who keep trying to stop these women from doing what they are called to do. From operating in their purpose. In their passion. Trying to stop these people. I'm telling you, he trying to figure out how he can halt this woman from creating these Ten of Pentacles partnerships with other people. From showing them how they can create Ten of Pentacles situations in their own lives with others. Whether that's Love, business, whatever type of partnership it is. This woman been heal helping people heal, guiding them to healing, guiding them to the light. 1212. And he's currently weighing his options, trying to figure out how he can stop her from doing this, how he can halt her, her ongoing method her ongoing movement to be in this energy three of swords high priestess he's sick secretly trying to figure out what he can do behind the scenes to have her in this energy and i'm sick of picking up on it you know something has got to give holy spirit because the effort that motherfuckers put into ruining other people's lives, you know, it just astounds me. Because I really be picking up that all this effort and drama and chaos and conflict they trying to cause for another. If they could redirect that energy into their own life, these motherfuckers could be millionaires. 13, 13, these motherfuckers would never have to punch a clock again. If they could re alchemize all of that negative energy into something positive because it is it's it's real confirmation it's been played out it's been played out now 1331 so he already secretly doing something now he may be working with somebody here there may be a pisces high priestess energy that this judgment it's working with right now to try to cause some sort of conflict and drama for this queen of wands. Clarify this high priestess energy, Holy Spirit. Five of cups, nine of swords. That's what he doing. So he, he doing something else to try to stop this woman because he thinks she the blind leading the blind child. Trying to have her in the five of cups, nine of swords, and in the tower. has enlisted a high priestess energy to help him take this bold and erratic action against this woman. Because he don't like this boss energy that she's sitting in. Because this her energy, and he don't like it. This her energy now, okay? He don't like that she's sitting in this energy all by herself. Remember now, she came out here as a queen of wands. A queen of wands, like I said in the beginning, that ain't nobody that's making no noise too funny or you wouldn't think could make no noise that's somebody who keep to themselves she stay in her lane she ain't 
trying to be out there like that. She can be, but she chilling. She just doing her own thing. Now, if it's bringing her the Emperor, King of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, that ain't her fault, okay? And obviously, that's what it's doing because she's bringing people, the Ace of Wands and the Ten of Pentacles and the Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Cups. So it's natural that she will see some of that that blessed energy in return, okay? And that's that's what's happening here. But he working with somebody, a high priestess energy, to have her in some sort of chaotic, destructive, depressive energy. To have her so broke down that she don't believe in herself enough to lead others out of the darkness. Because she's so deep in the dark. She's so down. She's so depressed. She's so dehabilitated. Page of Swords. And if people see her in this energy, Six of Wands, sideways, re going to be in the reverse, okay? If people see her in this energy, they're not going to believe that this woman can help them triumph over their own pain, their own darkness. They won't believe that she can help them achieve a victory if they see her in this energy. But that's not her vibe, honey, okay? And we all have our down days. We all have our moments where we want to wallow in our sadness and have pity for ourselves. But that's not her energy. That's not where she going to remain even if she has a moment in that state clarify holy spirit so whatever he got knight of cups she's going to still continue to make these offers to people show them love show them appreciation use her creativity and even her intuitive ability to help guide them to the light even if she feels restricted even if she feels like there's some sort of lack or misfortune going on in her life, she's still going to operate in this Knight of Cups energy. She's still going to give love, even if she ain't got that much to give now. That says a lot. Even if she is trying to heal and recover from something she may be going through, this woman's still going to try to show people love and light, show them what their futures could be, how happy they could be what they could achieve even if they keep moving forward in a positive way. She not going to stop doing that. It's giving alchemist her damn self. She didn't came out here now as the king and queen of pentacles, nine of pentacles with the emperor. That's how grounded this woman is. Okay. Ain't nothing blind about that. That level of common sense and wisdom and stability and centeredness that I'm picking up off of her. There's nothing out of whack, off kilter, insufficient about her energy that to what she's doing for what she's doing, she got, she's in the right headspace. She's got the right mindset to do what she is doing. Okay. There's no doubt about that. So whoever this judgment deaf energy is, he really need to go sit the fuck down somewhere. Because what I am seeing is that he ain't got more authority than she got. Not in the universe's eyes. Look at all this energy this woman is out here in. And the person that's trying to fuck with her, question her, her enlightenment ability, ain't out here past judgment and death. And he working with a high priestess to refute her. Okay, 1919, he working with somebody that's got to do shit behind the scenes in order to make some shit shake. Got to do some shit in secret in order to make some shit, sh some shit shake now. And that shit ain't going to be shaking. We already see that. Because even when this woman is in a low vibration about her own life, her own circumstances. She's still going to show up and show out as a pillar of strength for others. Page of Pentacles. That's her ongoing goal. Okay? 
and the future ain't been decided yet on this one because as long as she continues to choose to remain in the energy that she's in what this high priestess and this judgment death energy do is not going to work their goal to make her seem like she is not equipped with the knowledge or the wisdom or the insight to lead others to the light is going to be dismantled. That's what I just heard. Dismantled. Magician. Magician now. Because they in the page of Pentacles. Magician. Trying to stop this woman from being seen as a symbol of truth. And that shit finna be blocked. Because she's going to be able to continue to communicate her words of inspiration to others. She's going to be able to continue to move forward with her mission. You know, it's giving missionary work almost to a, to a certain extent. Okay? And this, this attempt to make people reject her offers, to make people not want to hear what she got to say or not believe that she is a divine source of wisdom that's going to have them in the ten of wands this queen of cups high priestess okay so i wouldn't do that magic for this judgment death energy or i would already stop if you you've been doing it i would stop while i'm ahead because this going to have her in the ten of wands and the nine of wands chariot because this queen of wands is going to keep moving forward she's going to remain in this chariot energy she could be like a leo cancer cusp because the moon did come out with the queen of wands but this this queen of wands here this queen of pentacles king of pentacles emperor nine of pentacles we finna let her get all her titles we ain't gonna count all them aces because that's what she be trying to give other folks. But that's why she's sitting once again in this high vibrational, stable, grounded, respected energy. Balanced. Ain't done blind about her. She quite, quite balanced. Okay? And this Queen of Cups is going to be in the Ten of Wands. The Nine and the Ten of Wands. She going to go from the... She going to end up in the 10, but she going to be in the 9 when she see that what she sent towards this woman only propelled her further ahead. And it's going to have her in some sort of laborious, fucked up ass energy with this 9 of Wands. She going to go from the 9 to the 10, fucking around with this judgment, death energy against this woman. Five of Swords. Fucking around with this King of Cups who angry about this queen of wands abilities and that's all it is okay any final messages so you know people can do what they want to do star but this woman is going to continue to operate in this healing energy and help people get their life in alignment she gonna keep talking that talk that she been talking that's been helping people get to the ten of cups and the ten of pentacles and the holy spirit says that's the truth because with this ace of swords what she's saying and doing is in fact is having a uh it's helping people have a victory it's helping people be successful it's helping people break through the fogginess the cloudiness the negativity in their life okay she freeing people i'm telling you she freeing people now she helping people go from the eight of swords to the ace of swords she could also have aquarius somewhere prominently in her chart as well okay but you know people need to find something better to do and i'm dropping the mic they do they need to find something better to do than be worried about what somebody else is doing because right now, all I can see is that this Queen of Wands is minding the business that's been paying her emotionally, physically, mentally, and spiritually. All of them, Elise, okay? And it's been blessing others in the same way. 
But if it doesn't apply, please let it fly. Take only what resonates, leave the rest, and I'll be back soon with another one, y'all. Peace.